In this video, we're going over how to reset your Samsung Galaxy S20 back to factory settings. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the mobile technology coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time we post new videos. Today we're going to show you how to reset your Samsung Galaxy S20 back to factory settings. The first thing you want to do is tap on the settings wheel at the bottom of the phone. If you don't have this button here, no problem. Swipe down from the top and tap on the settings wheel right here. From here, we're then going to go to accounts. So look for your accounts and backup tab here. Tap on accounts again. And any Google account you have, simply tap on it. Tap remove account and remove account. Press OK. And it's asking me to verify with my fingerprint. For you, it'll either be verifying with a fingerprint or whatever your uh, lock screen passcode is. Now, if you have other Google accounts on the phone, make sure you also erase those as well. You shouldn't have any Google accounts on the phone before you attempt a factory reset. We're gonna then go back two steps and go down to general management and tap on reset, factory data reset, swipe up and then tap reset into your pin or if you have a, a password on the phone, you're gonna to need to enter that. And then this is the last step. You're gonna tap delete all. From this step, it's gonna erase everything off of the phone and it's gonna set it up like a brand new phone. Now you will know that it is fully reset because the last screen you will see will ask you to enter, or excuse me, select a language. So don't touch the phone, give it anywhere from a minute to about five minutes to reset, erase all your information and set it up like a brand new phone. Mm -hmm. Hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care and as always, have a good one.